Hey guys, welcome to another Home Lab series video today. In today's video, we'll be showing you how to install Memos. Um, it's a kind of like note-taking app, kind of nice to be able to take notes, and then it actually even does it and shows you like which date you took the note on, kind of like a little bit, like kind of like a diary in a way that you can you can think about it. But it's kind of good so that you can like review notes when you took it and kind of just you know, make like even to-do lists or anything else um, for your, you know, note taking essentially. So this video is also sponsored by me, myself, and I. So if you enjoy my content, want to sponsor me or send me some free swag, let me know. My email is in the description below. So let's get started, guys. All right, so um, let's get started. We will log in to our server here. Um, so uh, we at one, I think 51 now. Um, Yes, and then we will install uh, Docker. It's a, this is another Docker application that we can run. So um, we'll add it to Config Manager, download docker.com, Linux, CentOS, and Docker CE .repo. Um, And then we'll just do yum install Docker CE. And we'll let that install. So while that installs, we'll set up DNS here uh, through our GitLab instance, um, edit, Open Web IDE and make sure we update our serial number here and then add our entry memos. Oh, no, not top complete, guys. Memos. A. <laughs> and 51. All right. Then we'll commit this and memos. and commit it. So uh, from here, we can look up memos docker container. Um, and uh, we can go to we can go to the GitHub first, actually, we'll go to the GitHub first. So essentially, they have their whole GitHub kind of their note taking privacy first lightweight note taking service is what they have here. So you can see how there's like your calendar reviews and whatnot key points. Um, we're going to go with their deploy in Docker. So actually, we're just going to essentially run this. Um, you can obviously like do do a Docker compose file with it, but we'll just essentially run this. So um, we should be able to access it but on port 5230 um, when this is up. So all right, so Docker's installed now. We will enable Docker and we'll start docker and then we should be able to kick this off so let's copy this off of the github paste that and run it so it'll obviously just download it um it's a pretty lightweight package actually so we can see here it's up um and it's running on 5230 um so we should be able to do http um, memos.dragon.local5230 and then you can see how there's this page. Um, we need to obviously sign up. <clears throat> oh, uh, dragon. Got to gotta actually enter information before you hit sign up, right? <laughs> so then you kind of get this really nice kind of looking page. There really, I mean, isn't much to it. It's just kind of like, uh, it looks a little bit like Twitter vibes a little bit when you, when you look at it from a post perspective, but you can make like first post save and you can see how on 925 which is today we made a post you can do filters and whatnot by clicking on here so that filters you can also create new tags by adding tags of like to do or something right you can have a to do tag and you can make you know checklist to do one to do two and then you can hashtag it to do uh, probably on a new line, obviously. Um, but then you can see all the tags that have to do and stuff like that. Um, you can also do attachments. Um, you can see your daily review of what you posted in daily. Um, and then you can kind of explore if there was other things to explore here. Um, but I mean, it's just kind of a very simple note taking. Um, you just kind of take take the notes as you need. Um, and that's like code block, block. I spelled that wrong, it's fine. Um, you can do code blocks also. Um, and yeah, so very simple to kind of keep track of your things using memos um, and tag and see on dates what you know you did. So that's how you essentially install and set up memos. If you do, if you like the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, uh, and we'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye.